Welcome back, everybody, to Pokemon Sword DLC. In the last episode, we got we finished up the Reggie su Reggie Reggie plot, and now we're finally going to do the main plot of the Crown Tundra, the thing that the place is named after, the King. So anyway, last time we got we got we got the wooden pillow, which is actually a crown oh, statue. Oh, you stuck by the fence! Oh, fence! <laughs> That's your Pokemon. Someone feels if it's missing something. It looks like the way to crack a fit under the statue. Do you want to try fitting it on? Russell, Russell. Schwunk? What was rustling? It's a wood. <laughs> the wooden crown fit perfectly on the statue! Crown own. Crow own. Crow own. It's me! Bye! Does it want you to follow it? Oh my goodness, I made it! Oh, crawl! Show me your strength. Already a Pokeball. Oh, well, wants our strength. Crown. Crawl, roll crown. Ha ha ha! So if you're wondering, you can't catch yet. Whoa, whoa. Your team is too nervous to eat berries! In fact, if you try... You wanna let its guard down. So instead... So, uh, let's give it our strength. We did it! <laughs> well, we wanted, well, it wanted our strength, so we kicked the flaming soccer ball at its face. <laughs> I don't see the problem, honestly. Car crown, crow, crown, crown, crown. Did you have fun? Oh, Rion, Crowion, Rarion, Cacaron, Recon, Cocker Crown, Crown, Recrown. Oi, oi, what's up? I heard a big ruckus coming from over here. What's this now, Chief? You, are you having a Pokemon battle? Oh. What a massive noggin! Um, um, What's this? Ah, mm. Oh yes, a sturdy body. Just as I expected. I hope he doesn't mind that I make use of it for the time being. Are you the Pokemon? Oh, I see you have grasped the situation already. Very astute of you. I am Colorless. I am the one known as the King of Bountiful Heart. I borrowed this man's body in order to thank you in person, so to speak. Indeed, there are no words to adequately express my gratitude towards you for restoring my statue. 
The day is long past. I reign over these lands as king. The humans offered me their loyalty and respect, and I was able to bring lush vegetation to the land and give them plentiful harvests year after year. However, it seems that over many, many years, the people of this land have forgotten my existence. They used to make offerings to me every year, but even that tradition has long since been lost to the ravages of time. You see, it is the faith of the people that grants me strength, and now I have lost all but a fraction of my former power. Even my royal steed has abandoned me. However, you were kind enough to restore my statue. That act has returned some strength to me. At least enough to speak to you by borrowing the body of another. Now, kind-hearted human child, I have a favor to ask of you. I must want know once and for all whether the people have truly forgotten about me. I wish you to speak to the villagers and ask if they remember the king of bountiful harvests. I have tried asking them myself, you understand, but they treated me like some sort of fairy tale creature. I flew into a mild panic at the sight of you. Please, kind hearted human, I beg you to help me. Yeah, he placed the crown, he could speak to you until he took you out of his body and I did burn for you. Come on, bunny. So what do you think about this, Leone? Good to know. 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 Welcome to Freezing Town. It must have been quite a journey to get here. The ground tundra is famous for carrots, you know. Maybe you'd be interested in getting some carrot seeds as a souvenir. Um, I'm Kyle, I didn't make my own. Now, now, no need to be shy. I must admit, these seeds are rather valuable to us. How about a trade? You bring me eight pieces of dynamite ore and I'll give you the seeds. Ho ho, that's all about fig. Fig Progo, or whatever the place was. The king of bountiful harvests! I used to believe it was real, you know. I was told that if I made mischief in the fields, the king would steal my body away. King of Bountiful Harvest? Well, if it exists, why doesn't he heal the land around here so we can grow crops for a change? Oh dear, I'm sorry, I'm rather busy doing nothing right now. <laughs> That's a mood! <laughs> that is a, such a mood! Poor <laughs> boar! Well, your name is Spiel. I got some lovely goods for sale. Beans? More beans? <laughs> beans. I'll never use these, but I bought them anyway. <laughs> anyway. Exactly 16. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. Well. All the cookies and her life. Do I remember the king of Bountiful Harvest? Why, of course I do! It's only the main tourist attraction of our lovely Freezington, after all. Imagine we would see more visitors if only the king were real. Report, soldier! Leone's the one in, in the 
Pewdiepie Army. My name is Pewdiepie. Oh, human child, I trust you are able to speak to the villagers. Did they say anything about me? Just like you are a fairy tale. Hmm. Is that why I suspect you? Nobody truly believes that I am you. Well, they will know once I once I execute all of them. <laughs> all right, kind human child. Now take this knife and purge the infidels. I'm, I'm more partial to the axe. Ah, uh, good idea. <laughs> Even ah, uh, less of a axe. mess. <laughs> It seems the people of this land have indeed forgotten the bond they once shared with me. Oh no, of course I am not grieving. I will kill you a bountiful harvest after all. I know better than to count on humans to remember me. Stupid humans. I hate all of them. They are nothing, they are nothing but tools. In my grand game of... Um, uh, checkers. <laughs> this proves beyond doubt that I cannot simply rely on human faith if I want my powers to return. If only my loyal steed will return to me, I will regain something of what I have lost. You there, Pokemon? No, oh, it is you. Get on all fours. <laughs> Yes, the four-legged Pokemon that I used to ride across the land. <laughs> I'm just imagining. <laughs> no, he just. My name is Beauty. No, he just ri rides Peony instead of <laughs> Peony's jumping around like but, a freaking bunny. <laughs> but my name is Beauty Steve. Very soon, Pokemon, that my statue in the village shows me riding. Alas, <sighs> in ancient times we spent many days together, dashing through the valleys and over the mountains of this land. My power waned, and I was forced to part ways with it. <laughs> now, I know not what it may be. Even if we should succeed in locating my loyal steed, I have my doubts as to whether it is made. Well, well. Also, please do not hold down on this. This is attached by screws. <laughs> I have lost so much power. Perhaps the villagers know something about my, uh, could be not so loyal steel. I would be in your debt if you could speak to the head of the village on my behalf. You are able to find every information at the world. I ask that you let me know. Whoa! Yeah. Chief, you're the best of Gargan. Or, wait, wait, it's Gargan. Still, I feel strange, like my body's not quite my own. Uh, I guess I'll head back to base to get some rest. Besides, it's freezing out of here. Eh. Uh, don't you wish these people who ask us to do stuff would, you know, help? <laughs> I am helping. I'm helping by staying the hell out of your way. I thought you were a one-off. You are the animal in the first bed. You are the new bed, but you are the hurry. The fairy in the chest bed. I am the young kids to the village. Yeah, I didn't need these eardrums anyway. You are the first bed field. You just keep going. Oh, Ziel also works there. Ziel! Huh.
bike. A bike, you know, a bike. That is a bike. Riding a bike around a bike, riding a bike. Which is a bike. Lives in by a biker, which is me, the biker. On a bike. I don't remember where the mayor is, so this might take a while. <laughs> Oh, I think I found the mayor. <laughs> I was I was trying cool. to talk about the squirrel, but sure. Alas! Oh yeah, it was me. Alas, this field is no good either. The soil is barren. No crop could possibly grow here now. Would you happen to be interested in gardening? Perhaps the lands of the crown tundra truly are beyond hope. What's this? Oh, our dear visitor, what brings you here? Hmm? You want to learn about the loyal steed of the King of Bountiful Harvests? Well, this is hardly the place for storytelling. Come to my home in Freezington. It's better to have a nice cat in the warmth after all. What are you talking about? It's the freaking grassy plain! Please visit whenever you're ready. I'll be waiting. Also, uh... Go, it's like, oh, you need to talk to this person. Oh, you need to go find them outside their house. Oh, now they're going back to their house. Well, at least it's not General White. <laughs> yeah. He still definitely qualifies as pal. Oh, there's houses over there. I know we asked for screen time for horror, but not like this. <laughs> Have you seen what's happened to the statue of the King of Bountiful Harvest? Its head has become massive. Like you. <laughs> hmm? You say that's the way the king's supposed to look? Now that you mention it, it does resemble the design on our town souvenir shirts. <laughs> But you speak as if you've seen the king with your own two eyes. No, I've seen him with my four eyes. Ah, you mean like your glasses. forehead. Except that wasn't. That statue's been broken since I was a child. Oh, of course, you want to learn about the loyal state of the king of Bountiful Harvests. Well, I don't know why you'd be interested in such things, but... Come, then, follow me. FOLLOW ME! An old book I read long ago said that the king's loyal steed was particularly fond of a certain special vegetable. Uh, my memory isn't what it used to be. I can't recall what exactly the steed so desired. I think it best that you search on the bookshelf over there if you want to find out any more. Can you search with me? No, I can't help you. I can't I'm read. I'm an NPC. I can't read. <laughs> I never learned how to read. The reigns of unity. The horse Pokemon, the two became one for a time. This proud steed became a wild thing once, but the king in all its greatness and for each among us who claims the steed's hide was black as the midnight gloom in which ghosts appear. There is another who claims it was white as a block of solid ice. Not a lot could say none with truth. By the frizzy tongue samba! Through these rays, through these rays did the king send its power in order to tame the rains in fact were made by the hands of the people and thanks to the plenty these rains Found not only the horse and the kings of one another at the dawning of each new year, we must never forget let the radiant flower and the mane of the steed, let the sicker of the sacred heart be passed parent to child to grandchild, and would you like to check any other parts? <laughs> the king was a great Pokemon with the sweep of its right hand, the sweep of its left hand, its great crown of green. <laughs> and in their footsteps, buds and so we worship the Pokemon. Would you like to check any other parts? Well, carrots can be grown in the crown when grown beneath the heat. Ice root carrots when grown in traps. Close to where souls are laid to rest. Shade root carrots are a favorite treat for many ghost-type Pokemon. Well, ice-type Pokemon seem to delight in eating ice root carrots. 
According to old fairy tales, the steed the king of Bountiful Harvest loved both records seem to contradict one another, while some stories speaking delighting and nice route mentioning a black steed. Do you want to read any of the other books? Isn't he tough dealing with the cold here on the tundra with temperatures while it's tempting to stay indoors? Trying to freeze to snow samba, lift both hands in the air, wave here, wave there, bow low, touch your toe and breathe. We pop up and start it out once more. Form a circle with your friends and don't be shy. Would you like to check any of the other books? I'm done reading. <laughs> if you want to learn! I will teach you how to guard it. You know, I just realized that we're going to be actually planting food and vegetables and such in this outfit. God damn it, how does this happen? Oh, according to plan. That's what my friends would say. Growl, <laughs> growl, growl. Hmm. Oh, hey there, Chief. I had a feeling someone called me. Was it you? Huh? <laughs> Human child, were you able to find something out in my by loyal speed? <laughs> you say you found out about something that my loyal steed could not resist? <sighs> It has been so long since we rode together that I had completely forgotten. With this information, we may be able to lure my loyal steed to me yet. So tell me, what is it that my loyal steed would find so irresistible? Freezing to snow samba. Carrots. Oh, carrots, you say? Yes, yes, I remember now. Even back when we were together, we would leap at any chance to eat some kind of crop. It took everything I had to restrain it. Looking back, the crop must have been carrots. I am in your debt, human child. And we must do now is clear. You are able to find carrots somewhere. It should be but a trifle to lure my loyal steed back to me. I wonder, will the humans of the village grow any carrots? We can obtain even a single seed. I could go a carry for them myself. Human child, would you happen to be just a little guy, I mean? <laughs> oh, well, as a matter of fact. <laughs> and we don't have enough dynamite ore. Guess what that means? Let's go get some dynamite ore. 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 Guess what that means. Guess what we have to do to progress the plot. Uh, uh, uh dual hop. I'm pretty sure we're right. So yeah, we need to do we need to do another Dynamax adventure to get Dynite Ore. If you don't have enough, this is the only way to get Dynite Ore, as to my knowledge. Cut. <laughs> Anyway, after after a after a love song about a hamburger, we've gotten a heat ran. <coughs> Cheeseburger. Same thing. It's a ham. You're like a hamburger without any ham. So a hamburger. Cheese burger. <laughs> Yay! I, I was just a realized. I was saying. I was saying. Jeez. Like Marianne, who was voiced by Xanthi Huynh. 
or Kyun, or however you pronounce her last name, who also voices Haru. <laughs> I thought she voiced. I thought she voiced Lawrence. I beg your pardon. <laughs> yeah, you're right. She's too good for that role. Anyway, we got the dynamite ore to buy some carrots. <laughs> so, uh, I may or may not actually like Lawrence. Where were you, human child? I was, I was, oh, 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 oh. I was singing at a cheeseburger. Have you found the carrots, human child? I found a cheeseburger. A cheeseburger? That strange bag contains the cheese of burger? Anyway. <laughs> you humans never stop adapting and evolving. I am constantly amazed by your ingenuity. And that you, the fields of the village, simply won't do it. They're not suited for growing carrots. If we divide rich soil, I can use my powers to grow the crops we need. And where might we find soil suited for growing these crops in this tundra of mine? Uh, I see two spots that might suit our needs. One is a field covered in pristine snow. Another spot is fulfilled by gravestones where those who moved on were laid to rest. Because we can't say they died, this is a kid's video game. <laughs> Either of those locations should allow me to use my powers if the other carrots we need. Death? Way too, way too harsh on the children. Being possessed? Perfectly fine! Please, I ask you to choose a field that Warn them! I should be getting in the habit of falling asleep outside! <laughs> Guess it just goes to show that holding down the floor isn't all that easy. Is it carry yourself, Chief? Don't overdo it! Also, get that head fixed! It's way too big! <laughs> Finally, I was able to find carrot seeds. I've found, well, there's two fields. I need to pick one. All right, go pick one. Uh, so, so as it said before, depending on which one you which one you do, you change the, you change you change the color of it and the type. If you pick the snow one, snow one, it turn it turns into it. The Pokemon will be an ice type and white. And if you pick pick ghost type, it'll be a black one and be ghost type. Black horse or black horse. So 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 the final one with with Calibrex himself is grass ice or grass ghost. Shadow facts or shadow mirror. Shadow facts or shadow mirror. <laughs> Lord of the Rings. Oh. Your elder scrolls. All people on the internet it is. So uh ghost. Okay. The ghost light. Why are we made her? <laughs> it's the ghost light! Man, manny. Oh, it's the old Sing that song about the King's Steed Pokemon. <laughs> this Eevee kid seems so happy. <laughs> oh, of course, my dear. I'd love to. Eevee, I think you! 
I threw carrots cold as ice and munched on up by the bully in white. She threw carrots dark as doom, crunched by the bully with a ghostly gloom. Now you make sure you eat your veggies too, just like the Pokemon in the song. Yes, man. So after hearing that run, has your choice changed? You're still going ghost or white? We're still we're still a we're still a senior citizen browsing the internet. Field. I'm pretty sure Pete, this Pokemon Pikachu was an electric type. Boom. A hyper potion! Alright! So it's not the place. <laughs> Guess it's not the place. Girder! No, well, we already have a girder. Girder! We already have one, Joel. Girder need another wife. Well, <laughs> Well, there. Here, there's the evolved form of Girder. <laughs> Girder Take only that. into young Girder. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Girder like a wife the same way he like wine. Fourteen years old and locked up in basement. <laughs> Was it Girder females? Yes, it was. <laughs> Why did you say talk like a, talk as a bear? Because we, because oh, because all girders are same. What are the are our husband of the same girder? Even girl girders. For which type you want the the steed to be, but meanwhile the Reggie's like 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 the electric one's way easier. Good luck with getting the fire one, dumbass. <laughs> Very well. May I ask that you plant the seeds? Dig, dig, dig. You planted the carrot seeds in the field. You definitely weren't listening to death metal in the, during the process. Pat, 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 now then, it is time to do my part. Let me show you my powers! Go oh, now, round now! Crawl round! Whoa! 
flowing, power surging into me. Ah! Doink! I planted so many seeds, and my power is going to get one to go. You suck. It's all your fault, human child. <laughs> Falling so low, it truly breaks my heart. But soon it will be time to bid my sorrow farewell. Now, human child, I must ask that you pull that shade room carrot free with all your might. We'll do that next time. You need to get some help. Some, some help from. Maybe you should get a hop to help. Because as everybody knows, Boys, you're strong!